Hello and welcome to this tutorial on how to play Knights of the Old Republic on Windows 8. This tutorial is going to go over how to fix this particular problem. When you launch the game, it goes from the LucasArts logo to the Bioware logo, then the screen goes black and it crashes to the desktop. If that's the problem, this is how you fix it. First, go to the folder in which the game is installed. For me, it is Computer, C Drive, uh, Program Files x86, LucasArts, and then Knights of the Old Republic. In that folder, you must have the SWconfig exe and the SWKOTOR exe. If the Steam version doesn't have it, let me know in the comment section down below and I will upload it so you guys can have these files. First thing you need to do is hit the SWconfig exe. In this uh, little uh, menu, hit Disable Movies. That will get rid of the uh, LucasArts and Bioware logo when this game launches and it will just go straight to the menu and Hopefully this will just be it and that's all you need to do. So hit apply and then you should be able to use the game. If that doesn't work, uh, go to the SW KOTOR EXE, hit properties and go over to compatibility. You can either run the compatibility troubleshooter or you can just try this. Hit run this program in compatibility mode 4, try service pack 3 for XP and go down to the bottom and hit run this program as an administrator and hit OK and apply. Now, if the game doesn't work after you did all of that, go into your graphics card settings and toggle the anti-aliasing. That could be the problem. I'm not 100% sure, but uh, if you did all that, you tried the anti-aliasing thing with your graphics card, leave a comment down below and we'll try to help you figure this out. Because this game is awesome and uh, if you have Windows 8, I don't want you guys to be left out from experiencing this game. So thank you guys for watching this tutorial. Please thumbs up if this helped you and subscribe if you want to see more of our videos. We will be having a new Galactic News this week, hopefully. And you can check out our website, gwgnetwork.com, for more Star Wars video game and movie news. Thank you guys for watching again, and I will see you next time.